Hi there. Annoying cat about to be kicked off the desk. Okay. So, <laughs> war be totally behind me. An another installment of if people would just listen to me. Uh, so, as you know, I'm a Sensi consultant. Um, Sensi Brands consultant because I sell, I also make sell Velada. And I recently signed up to um, be part of Grace Adele, which I'm totally excited about. The cat is a girl cat named Gerald, and she's crazy. Just to introduce, since she insists on being part of the video. Um, so, I hate, really strongly dislike when people say you know, FML and things like that. And it, I can tell it's always around money or I want a new job or things like that. And then I try not to be real pushy with Sensi Brands and Grace Adele because I realize people feel like I'm coming off as, oh, she, you know, she makes money off this. She's a consultant, blah, blah, blah. I get that. I, I really, really do. Because, I don't know, I, I think the stuff with Sensi can feel like it's too good to be true. But if you are working it, you will make money. That's what it boils down to. And I love the products. And I think the love of the products and the fact that it's a quality product that this company stands behind also says a lot. Uh, I can name you 10 people minimum that I know personally that would be fabulous and yet they hesitate. I quite frankly am in a spot in my life where I wish I had discovered it a year earlier. Um, one of the other directors a few months ago had a thing on her website or Facebook page that said, I really would hate it if a year from now you tell me that you wish you'd signed up a year ago. And I truly feel that way. I get that jumping in on the ground floor, like with Velada and Grace Adele, I get where that can be a little, like you don't really understand it. But, um, people spend money on bags. People spend money on chocolate. Both Grace Adele and Velada are teaching people, are, are new ways of thinking about, like fondue. Okay, so Velada is a chocolate fondue. Oh, that's cute. I hear it all the time. And I, there isn't a single person out there who has not been uh, thoroughly impressed by the quality of the chocolate. And yet, it's, sales are okay. Um, uh, it's amazing. It's an amazing product. It's a new way of thinking about fondue. It's not the, I need to melt this on the stove, I need the double boiler, I need to do this, I need to do that. It is put the bag in the microwave for 45 seconds, smoosh it around, put it back in and make sure it's fully melted, pour it in. You can have a delicious dessert in less than three minutes, or you can simply have a way for your kids to eat chocolate in three minutes. Yep, oh, fruit, sorry chocolate is a given um the white chocolate's fabulous the dark chocolate's fabulous the milk chocolate's fabulous i am not really big into sweets so the milk and the caramel chocolate they're okay to me the dark chocolate off the chart uh my family likes the white chocolate with oreos dipped in they have good metabolisms so they can do that um but it's truly the ground floor and it's a new way of making people think about it. And 
I don't know. I just feel it's it's the cusp of something really, really big. And I want people to be making their dreams come true. It was really funny. Yesterday on my computer, I was looking through and I found an old bucket list, shall we say. Um, and the bucket list stands true to my Pinterest bucket list. Uh, Courtney Edwards Pinterest, if you want to go look at my, check out my bucket list and my pins. And yes, I have a Fifty Shades of Grey cast pin board. Um, but the things I got to cross off that bucket list, with the exception of the master's degree, which was partially paid for or supported because I was involved with Sensi, so that. But the other things that I crossed off the bucket list were all because I was part of Sensi, because Sensi made a trip possible. Because I don't know about you, my bucket list is a whole lot of travel going on, and. Quite frankly, it's not something that I learned to prioritize traveling. Um, growing up, I'm learning to prioritize traveling, and I enjoy getting on the airplane. Takeoffs are my favorite thing, except when you're on the way home. That's not quite as fun. Um, so, ground floor of Grace Adele. I bet there are people who wish they had invested in some of the higher end handbags when they were first starting. And I'm sure there are people who went their handbags, really. But I know Gilmore Girls referenced a bag that was $16,000. Granted, I'm not buying a bag for that price ever. Um, I would rather buy a car for someone who needs it than to buy a bag like that for myself. Just how I roll. Um, so I think the prices in Grace Adele are reasonable for the higher quality than you're going to get at some of the, the mid-range retail markets. I also think that the mix and match piece to the the Grace Adele line is just totally exciting because you can have just one of the bags, which is the higher end of the expense, and then get the clip-ons, so you can get the clutches that make it so it's a new look every time. It, it's not rocket science, but we all know a good bag is hard to find. Um, but this is the ground floor. This is where it starts. This is where people can build a team of pe like-minded people who are excited by fashion. Um, again, for those who know me, I have never been a purse girl. I have never been, I started carrying purses in 2004 when one of my professors made a comment about my backpack. Um, to that point, I had three boys and always needed um, how do we say, I always needed some kind of, like, ball, matchbox cars, you know, I threw, threw my wallet, my camera in, I was good. Um, Grace Adele also fits my camera, and you don't really know you're carrying a camera, so, for the record. Um, so, uh, at that point, I started carrying, carrying a purse. I, and I still have that first purse that I started carrying. And then I got a car that matched the purse. So <laughs> life was good. Uh, you think I'm kidding? I'm really not kidding. My Explorer perfectly matched my first purse. It was green. It's my color. What can I say? Um, so then I am one of those. I, I can go into any store find something I like, and I guarantee it's going to be the most expensive thing there. It's a gift, really. <laughs> um, but, with Grace Adele, this is cutting edge. This is the beginning. I can like anything. They're all the same price. Um, 
So that's kind of cool too. Oh, of course, except for the leather, which I do love. Um, but it's so hard for me not to just want to shake people and be like, you could, do, you can do this. And yes, it's your own business. Yes, you, you have to do the work. Aren't you doing it anyway? Aren't you out there working for the proverbial man? And not that there's anything wrong with any of that. And I think it's hard because we get in such a fear-based place. Which again, I always try to avoid that fear-based place. But, you know, add it up at $9 an hour or $7.25 an hour or even at $12 an hour. That's a lot of time away from your family, quite frankly. That's a lot of time spent standing around, being pushed around, working somebody's schedule f that they set up for you. That's having to ask for time off and not sure if you're going to be able to get it. That's you have a sick kid and they make you feel like crap for calling in sick. Been there, done that. Um, you own your own business. You know, I just had one of my consultants send me a message saying, you know, one of her downline had had an emergency come up and she took she's taking over the party for her and and how she was honored to, to be able to take it over for her and fill in and, and be there in support of her her person as well. You know, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. It's just a different feel. And I understand it feels too good to be true. I'm here to tell you it's not too good to be true. If you work it, if you really engage with Sensi Family Brands and what they have to offer, you would not, you will not be disappointed. You will be like, I wish I'd done it sooner. So that's my plea. Talk to me. I, I'm really, I have not drank the Kool-Aid. There is no Kool-Aid to, to be consumed. Um, I just got back from the conference and yes, it is a different company who believes in giving back more than they take. Does your boss think that way? Does the company you work for believe that? Does the company you work for set it up? So if you do your job and do it well, you're off to Oahu next J June or Costa Rica next May or New York City in April. The company I work for does. And next year, the, con the convention is in Indianapolis. So excited. Not really a bucket list place, but hey, I'm always up for an adventure. So if you're up for an adventure and you'd like to hear more about the opportunities that Sensi Family Brands has to offer, please contact me. Uh, again, harborsense at gmail.com is my email. I love sharing these opportunities with you. Love it. Um, I'm honored to work with people as a career supporter, as a sponsor, it just, it, it makes me happy to watch people grow. Why I went to counseling, uh, why I got a master's degree in counseling is because I love watching growth in people. And this company allows me to do it and allows me to, to watch people and celebrate people. And you can make money while you're doing it. I promise. So if you're interested, again, HarborSense at Gmail. And then, otherwise, the website is http harborsense.sensi.us. And all three brands are actually shown. If you want to go see what Grace Adele or Velada is about, it's in the lower right-hand corner. Just click on the website, and it'll take you to, to those individual websites. 
All right. So if you want to make it better, check it out. Talk to me. I'm seriously low pressure, but really, it's good stuff. All right. Have a great day. Talk to you soon. Bye.